that today I was searching my entire zoo for toxic poisonous cane toads that are invading my property. I think there's one here, there's movement. You see that? The lid is moving. There he is. Let's get him in the shallow end. He's coming right here. Then we're just gonna shoot all the poison on the brick. What is up everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope all of you guys are having just an absolutely amazing day and for those that are new here, well I'm Jacob and welcome to my jungle. If you guys saw the title and thumbnail, you will know for today's video that today I was searching my entire zoo for toxic poisonous cane toads that are invading my property. Yes, you heard that right. My property has been overrun with these poisonous toads. Since it's summertime now, it's been raining. These toads literally come out of the woodworks and they have been everywhere. Today, I went around and rounded up as many of these invasive toads that I could find. Now, why are these toads so bad? Why are they poisonous? Because these toads actually have a neurotoxin that they produce in their gland. It's like a white paste that when licked, ingested, can cause hallucinations, it can cause you to vomit, it can make you extremely sick and ill. So I don't want them here, mainly for me, but more importantly, because of my animals. My dogs could eat them, my cats could eat them. They are just not a good animal to have. If you live here in South Florida, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So today, I went around my entire property and all I'm gonna say is, we had a serious infestation. I found a lot of them, so that's all I'm gonna tell you guys. So if you wanna know how many of these toxic toads we found, where they are now, what the heck is going on here on my property, well guys, you are in the right place and we're gonna hop right into that. So the first area I'm going to check is my pool. It's been raining a lot. There's one right there. There's one swimming across the surface. Look, there's one of the invasive toads right there. You can see him, he's in my pool right now. The pool's about to overflow with water. There's one, oh my gosh, he's right there. Now wait, oh, there's movement right here. You see that movement? Oh, I think there's one here. There's movement in the water. Do you guys, you see that? There's there's movement right there. There's a lot of movement there. Oh my God, there's another one here. Look, look, there he is. Let's get him in the shallow end. Here he is. First one of the day, look at that. Look, 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 see him? Look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. He's swimming in the pool. Look! No way, he's swimming in the pool. That's our target species. We got one, he's sitting on the bottom of the pool. So there's one here. We might need a net to get him. You can see that he's just way on the bottom, just kind of hanging out. So he's down there. And then I see another one, he's right here. The other one is right here. We might be able to grab him. I'm seeing just, just one so far. Oh, 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 there he is. He's going under, he's going under, he's going under. This is crazy. Look at him, look at him. So hopefully he's gonna just glide up to the surface. And when he does, I'll be able to catch him, but now we got both toads underneath the water right now, which that is not what I wanted. We've got another one here, so I don't know what to do right now. Let's see if he's gonna come on up. But this is this is crazy that we just found two of them right now. I mean, it rained all night long. We still have some puddles left from the rain, so we might need. I think I'm gonna need a net to get him. So I just saw that toad right there. He's coming up to the surface. He just came out of there. So we got one, two, three toads here. But oh, oh, it's, the lid's moving. The lid, do you guys hear that and see that? The lid is moving and there's water right here on the outside like something's been about. Oh, look, he's right here, look. Look, there's one right, I don't know if you can see it, but look, there's a toad head. Oh, it's moving. The lid is moving, so I'm gonna open it up right now. Let's see. Oh my god. Wait, I got one. Wait, wait, come here. Oh no, he went in the pool. No, he went in. All right, now there's five of them. There's one, two, three. There's a fourth one right over there. And then there's five in my hand. This is insane. All right, we're gonna need a bin for this. That was crazy. They're in the pool skimmer. But let me show you guys right now why these toads are so bad and so toxic. So if you come right here, you could see this right here, you can see when we squeeze right here, you can see right here I'm squeezing and all of this white is coming off. And that right there is that toxin that I'm telling you guys about. This toxin right here is not good at all. And they have a gland right here. And then this right here is another gland. It will secrete this, this toxin from almost their entire body. You can see there's some more right here. This stuff is not good at all. So we wanna get this guy in a bin ASAP and we're gonna have to get a net and get the other toads. 
So this is gonna be our trusty toad bin for the day. So I'm just gonna open this on up and put our toad in here. So right now there's one toad inside of the bin. There's four more in the pool, so that's a total of five. But we wanna close this on up. It's not airtight, so it's gonna be perfect for the toads. But what I need you guys to do right now is comment down below, how many of these invasive toads are we gonna find on the property? We're already at five so far, which is crazy. So we might find up to 30, 40 of them, maybe even a couple hundred. Okay, so there's one right here, and then there's another one at the surface. I don't want him to see me. Oh, got him. Look at that. Caught him. Another, oh, no, where are you going? I caught him. Another, another invasive toad. This one's like mm, medium size. He's not so big. So we got another toad right here that we want to get in the bin. We definitely want to get him in ASAP with the other toad right here. Oh, and there he goes. So we got two so far. Now it's going to be tricky to get the rest. Because they definitely don't want to get caught. Look, here he is. He's right here. One. Guys, one, two. Oh, no, I missed it. There's two more toads right here. There's one here. But I want to sneak up on this guy. It's right here. Look at him. He's right here. Got him. Oh, this is a big one. This is, I think, the biggest one yet. Look at this. This one's like a super light color right here. You can see this one's more of like a, a golden color. So we've got him here. we got one. One more, baby. One more. Now, even though these toads are an invasive species, they are extremely cool. A lot of people keep this same species as pets. So you can see, look at, he's got these incredible big eyes right here. And can't. Oh my, oh my gosh, look at him. <laughs> he's making crazy, little crazy toad noises. Look, he wants me to put him down. He's breathing, but look at that. Oh, look at all of that toxin. Now, I don't want to squeeze it too much. Definitely don't want to get this in my eye. So, buddy, we're going to put you in a bin now, okay? You're going to be okay. All right, buddy, here you go. You go in with the rest of your friends. Oh no, he's getting out, he's getting out. All right, buddy, you're in with your friends, bye. So there's another toad right here that's kind of hidden. So what I want to do right now is come. Got him this time. Another super light colored cane toad. He was just making his little noises. Look at him, he's chirping. Look at him, he's so cute. Yes, yes, yes. How are you doing, sir? Yes, yes, you're very nice, you're very cute. So far we caught four out of the five toads in the pool, but right now, let's see if I can get double fisting. Let's see if we can catch him. Now we don't want to spook him. Look, he's right here. He's coming to the surface. We want to catch him. We don't want to spook him because if we spook him, he's not going to want to come. Guys, look, he's coming right here. I got him. Look at that. Under the water catch. We got two more of these toxic toads and that is the rest of them from the pool. So the pool was holding five of them after last night's rainstorms. So let's get them in the bin and let's keep searching for more. Come take a look at this. So right now we got three in here and now we're gonna add two more, but we gotta be quick because they'll hop right out. But look at that, we got five so far. Five is a great start, so let's keep searching. So right now I just made it to area number two where I suspect there's cane toads and that is underneath, right, right there. Look at that, he just shot out from underneath this metal. So right here, it stays nice and humid. And for the most part, it's a little bit sunny now, but for the most part, it stays nice and shaded. And where the shade is, is where these is where these toads like to be. They like to be hiding under stuff, underneath stuff. So I, at nighttime, I always see them running underneath these pallets right here. You see, they can slip right under. So I'm sure there's a lot more here, but this guy just came out from underneath it. This is probably the biggest one of the day so far. You could see it's absolutely massive. Again, look at this brick right here. I'm gonna show you that we're just gonna shoot all the poison on the brick. You could see it's sticking to the brick right here. All of this neurotoxin right here, which is really bad stuff. So right now we just got a massive one, but let's lift this up right now and see what we got on here. One, two, three. Look right there, there's another one right here. Got him right here. Look at him. Another one and he's missing his foot, look. This one must have gotten in some kind of an injury where you could see now on one side he's got his hands and the other side he's got a nub but these amphibians are incredibly resilient so that missing that arm is not bothering him whatsoever you could see he's still a nice fat and healthy cane toad right here bufa or marine toad those are all different names for these guys so we got these two toads so let's get them in the bin and keep searching all right we got to be really quick right now so we're going to open this up right now one two three look at that we got five so we got one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven toads so far, guys. This is this is pretty crazy. So we got seven toads so far, and that is really good because we don't want these toads around our animals. 
because these seven toes removed, that could mean saving our dogs because again, the dogs sometimes will grab those and when the dogs bite them, it's never good. One hour later. All right, so it's been over an hour now since I've been searching for the rest of the toads and you guys are not going to believe how many toads I have in this bin right here. I, I, I honestly don't think there could possibly be any more toads on this property, but right now, the moment you've been waiting for, we're gonna open it up. I'm gonna show you how many we got, so we're gonna come over here right now in three, two, one. All right, this guy almost got out. Look at this. I think we have like 20K toads. They're all coming out. Oh my gosh. All right, so we just had a minor escape. I caught all the escapes, but I'm gonna try to grab a handful of them so you guys can see them. So I'm just gonna open this up right now. I'm just gonna go like this, just like that. And look at this. Look at all these toads. We have a whole bunch in this hand right here. So I actually have a friend that collects cane toads. We're gonna give all of these to him. And well, that my friends is going to end today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video, catching these toxic poisonous invasive species here on my property. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below your favorite part of today's video. And if you guys are not yet subscribed yet to me, you wanna see more toxic toads, you wanna see tigers, lions, turtles, and tortoises, and all kinds of crazy animals. Well guys, all you have to do is go right now, hit the subscribe button, tap that little notification bell, and you'll be notified whenever I post.